Okay, without being too much of a creeper, you guys have to see the bathrooms. It is a nice view. Okay, let's find our room. It's so weird coming up this way. I think we might be in the same room we were in last time. Hello friends. Welcome back to my channel. And um, today, we are not at Indiana Beach. We are in Shipshawana. Yeah, and we, this is the same room we had. And let me, she have a I, cool I didn't realize that Caroline was going to take over the vlog, so I had to stop and flip the camera. Go ahead, baby. Tell it's us. It's great. Give us a room tour. Well, there's a chair right here. Like, you would tell stories over here because there's this big light right there. <sighs> And I did bring a book, but I'm sure there's a Bible somewhere. Yeah, and you know what? I actually brought my Bible. So that's perfect, huh? I guess there's two Bibles now. And I brought my favorite black jacket. Yeah. Oops, okay, and well, here's the nice TV stand. You've got a microwave, extra pillows. Down yes. here is your fridge. But guess what? I brought my llama corn. You brought your llama corn. And, oh, it's off. I forgot. We brought the daddy. <laughs> Standard little nightstand, except that it's all Amish made furniture, which means it's amazing. Not a whole lot of like drawers if you were going to stay for a long time, but enough for the one night, especially that we're doing. Mirror. Let me turn the light on so y'all can see better. Here we go. Ironing board even. I don't iron even when I'm home. Bathroom with a nice big sink. We've stayed here a few times. Hi. So anytime that we come down to ship show up east, up, down, I don't know. Sideways. Sideways. <laughs> when we come sideways to ship Shawana, we always stay here at the Van Buren. It's yeah. beautiful. We'll take you guys with us to the pool. Yeah. That is what Caroline is the most excited to do. Yeah, because I learned how to swim this summer. Yay! Caroline likes to fully unpack her bags. And I also <sighs> am learning how to go underwater and I've been going underwater too much. Good story. Um, <laughs> So yeah, we'll take you with us a little bit as we have fun this weekend. Special bonus to our room. This robin seems to have a nest right outside of our window. I don't see any babies, but it's still kind of cool. One of the perks to this hotel, which I didn't even show you guys. Super pretty. Is how close it is to food. More importantly, pizza which you guys know that I love. So this time we've chosen to dine in. Last time I just came in and picked it up when it was ready and took it back. But it is now 4.18 their time, 3.18 at home. And I haven't eaten anything all day. So the hanger is real. We found this, it's really cool. Out of town visitors. All the way from like South Africa. That's pretty cool. India. Okay. Caroline got a personal pizza. We went with the thick crust because we're used to Pizza Hut. So I figured she'd like that better. And she eats the crust here. She leaves the crust at Pizza Hut. So that's a good thing. I got the Philly cheesesteak. I've already eaten half of it. And I told them no mayonnaise. And it's still really good, even without the mayonnaise. So that's exciting. Sean got the chicken parmesan and it looks really good. Okay. With some, he added some green pepper. Caroline, sure. what are we about to go do? Pool time. Pool time. Oh, that lighting's better. How excited are you? It's all you've talked about all day. <laughs> Goggles already on her head. 
She's gonna jump through this window and into the pool. There's my little fish. <laughs> Look at how beautiful this is. Our favorite part is when the buggies go through. There's none coming right now, but. Yeah? <laughs> Daddy. What are you doing to your father? Oh, the security camera? I hope they're catching all this. <laughs> right. I missed it. Almost. Hold on. I'm going to look through the little window. There it goes. I swear, I'm going to get one through the big window eventually. Okay. So they're on the other side of the road. But here they come. Oh, I love it. Like, where else can you swim and see this kind of view? Here he goes again. Hi. <laughs> Our friends made it. The llama corn is a hit. Oh my god. Okay, good. This is a poor one. Well, in the words of one of my favorite vloggers, Adam Hatton, good morning. <laughs> Um, everybody has vacated the room for now. It's breakfast time. So we usually go out to a little restaurant called Five and Twenty. And at the Five and Twenty, there's a really good breakfast buffet. Sean and I have been really strict about counting our calories lately. Um, and that paired with the fact that our friends didn't get here till late and the girls didn't get to swim. We want them to be able to swim this morning. And we really have until about four o'clock before the stores out here start to close. So we are gonna try the hotel breakfast for the first time and then let the girls swim so that we're out of the, the room by checkout time, which is 11. And we can go enjoy the rest of the day out here. Morning swim time is almost oh, over. Buggy. buggy, where? Oh, down there? That's Brian, he's not a buggy. <laughs> because you're too far from the window. Oh, time to play. <laughs> First stop is going to be the White Barn. It's usually our last stop and we're exhausted, so I'm excited to start here. And then we can go across the street to the Blue Gate. I love the Blue Gate. So I found these earrings, they were $10.50, and then I found this penguin. It's so cute. I had to have her. Yeah, she has I always say no to stuffed animals because we have so many, but she's so cute. She has a white skirt on. In the mall. Restrooms, the bottom floor. Love the third floor of the mall here in Shipshawana. It's a very famous picture. And oh, this is where the carousel is too. Second floor. We're gonna go back up two, three, but Brian is looking for something. <laughs>
one of the coolest parts is the giant tree. No, it doesn't? Okay. Hold on, girls, don't let go. This carousel is from 1906. And the machine will eat your money, so be careful with it. How often do you get to go on a carousel that overlooks rooftops? This place has insane cotton candy flavors. They're really good. We've gotten a few different ones before. Huge array of taffy. Novelty stuff. Ice cream break. Fresh. Okay. So we just had ice cream and now we are at ENS. The kids call it the playground. All of this stuff is for sale. This is Caroline's favorite. So if anybody feels like giving me $10,000, I mean, then I can get her this tower. <laughs> Up in the tower. And I'm having so much fun. This is one of Caroline's favorite stops. I feel like you can tell why. <laughs> Take my picture, Dad. whole room of fake fireplaces. Okay. Look at the little baby. Oh, he's so cute. I don't know. It doesn't matter. He's adorable. Okay, so everything closes around 4, 4.30, and it is now 2.30. So we are going to stop here. Where am I? I don't know if you can tell. It's Yoder's Meat and Cheese. Uh, the Red Barn is also right next door, and it has, it's like a, like a mall, kind of. Um, but Yoder's Meat and Cheese is our favorite place to stock up on all of our good brats and hot dogs, and they have the best milk. <laughs> you gonna get a cart? All right. So, usually by the end of the day, everybody's starting to get tired and cranky. What? Um, so we are gonna finish off the day at the Blue Gate, which is a whole experience in itself. It's beautiful, they have a store inside, the food is amazing. So that's where we're going. To go to the Blue Gate, we're gonna park over here, same place we parked for the White Barn. Um, or you could park behind it and walk if you want to. The turkey dinner? Yes. Yeah. Looks good. Just like my Now, this is the best place ever. <laughs> All right. Glub, glub. All right, girls, I think it's time to go home. Bye, Yo. friends. Bye. Bye, bra, bra. <laughs> That's it. Another trip in the books. We're full. We're very, very full. Food was amazing, but very, very full.